Oh man, I'm getting all excited about it. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Dave Coast. I am the owner of DFW ATV. We're a custom fabrication shop in Dallas, Texas. My name is Alan Kelly. I'm with MLC CAD System SolidWorks in Dallas, and I'm one of our sales reps. And yeah. tell us what all vehicles. We do Polaris, we do Can-Am, we do uh, Honda, we do uh -huh. Kawasaki, um, we do some Arctic Cat. We do all the major brands. And so people bring us machines that are in stock form and then they put a wish list of things that they want to do together. They want to do a cage, they want to do audio, they want to do a lift, wheels, tires, performance. Um, we do everything except for internal motor and transmission work. Got it. So any possible thing that they could ever add to one of these things, that's what we do. I know I'm going to try to bring mine to them one of these days <laughs> <laughs> whenever, whenever I get a chance to do it. Every single project that we build, uh, we usually have a write-up about it. We usually list all the parts that we have. So there's a huge gallery of pictures and projects and stuff to go through on our Facebook page. I was doing 2D work on my plasma table and I was just cutting basic shapes and triangles and things with holes and I was using the CAD software for my, that came with my plasma table. I mean, it was so hard to line things out. I don't know how people do it. And so I started doing some research online and people were like, oh, you need to get a real CAD software, you know? And I'm like, all right, so what do I need? You know, SketchUp or something? And they're like, yeah, you know, that would work, but maybe you might want to look at SolidWorks. It didn't take me very long, maybe a couple weeks and I was doing 2D drawings. I was, you know, Looking back, none of them were correct, but they were they were good enough to send something to my plasma table um, and, and cut out a part. We were building roll cages. We had a really nice uh, CNC bender, but we would you know take a measure with a protractor and look at it, and then kind of knew what the spring back was and make a bend and kind of look and see how it would be. He goes, you got bad information. He goes. You know, we could draw you the best drawing in the world, but it's not going to fit if you don't know where you're starting. So I said, well, what do I got to do? And he's like, you're going to have to get some kind of metrology device to figure out how to measure this thing. And I'm like, a metrology device? I'm like, okay, I don't know what I need. So I, I start watching YouTube videos, which is like my go-to learn source. And I see Jay Leno on there with a feral arm and he's scanning car parts and somebody's taking it into SolidWorks and next thing you know another guy's machining this and he's got a copy of the part back and I was like that's pretty cool and it didn't take me very long before I quickly realized like the power of this right so I bring the arm to the machine and I, I 3d scan the machine okay. and then what I do what's really helped me lately is with SolidWorks is I'll draw it on there I'll do the weldments on there I can change the colors and all this other different stuff but I can sit there right with a customer I can literally design a whole cage on a machine in 15 minutes now, right? And I can do it right while a customer's sitting in my seat. So I'll scan it and they'll say, well, hey, I want to know what it's going to look like. And I'll say, well, just meet me at one o'clock. And they'll meet me and see me draw it up. And they'll get to see a demo wow. of what it's going to look like. And they have an idea of what their new thing is going to look like. And they can make revisions and okay it. And then I can send it off to my machines and they'll cut and bend it. So. It's taken my production time, which would normally take a couple days to do something. I can do it in 15, 20 minutes now. From wow. 15, 20 minutes from the time I leave my office, the pieces can be cut and bent on the ground, ready to go. And to me, that's revolutionary. You know, I can do things way faster and way more efficient than, than what some of my competitors have. With the technology that we have in the shop, I'm able to get things done at higher quality and a faster turnaround time which allows machines to come in and out, allows me to be more profitable, but more importantly to my customers, allows them to have their timelines met. So most of my customers that come to me, come to me for a couple different reasons. One, they know that our quality standard is the top. Like I'm, I'm an enthusiast myself. I want my stuff perfect. I won't let something leave out of the shop unless it's to the standards that I would want, which is the best, right? And then I want, you know, I want my stuff on time. So if someone promised me something a certain day, I'll do it. 